Oh. No. Well, there's a gate. Uh, I should have been paying more attention. This is weirdly slow. Oh, it looks like we've got the gates. We've got everything. So, yeah, we should be able to get back down there. Oh, God. Is this thing like Crater Planet? Wait. What is that? Oh, these are spots. These are spots that I can land on. Well, we've got a gate there, so I should probably not mess around with that. Or, no, I want to get closer to that. I just wanted to see if we had any other gates as we went by. Yeah, here's one. Because if I can actually have a, a base next to a gate... Oh my god, is that directly next to a gate? That's, like, hellaciously fortuitous. <laughs> this is incredibly convenient. Okay. So what do we got? Medium storage. Now, it doesn't look like... Okay. So we've got the RTG. We've got these things. That's just oxygen. I don't... Well, we got resin for days. And some more stuff. Okay. I'm just going to plug these together. We've got that. We have the extra solid fuel thruster. I don't need to carry that around with me. These things either. I guess we can just store them for the time being. Because, yeah, we've still got this booster. Okay, good. And I should have enough compound kind of hanging out? Yeah, there it is. Let's see, if you have a beacon, you can save a landing site. Good to know. Uh, my my immediate goal is probably to get a, a soil. Uh, one of the soil things down so I can actually just start generating some basic... Well, I mean, honestly, I, I want to generate, like, compound and resin and stuff so I don't actually have to work for them. Okay, so we need we need a small printer. What requires a small printer? Small printer is compound. Wait, I don't have a full set of comp. What? I didn't. I didn't get enough compound from that. I'm impressed, and shocked, and frustrated. What I'd like to do, I think, uh, for future runs, once we've got the the better shuttle, is I'm probably gonna want to bring the, uh, the soil fabricator along with me. So they, they give the same amount of research. That's, that's just a straight up seed. Eh, back before I die. Okay. Don't actually know if planting that thing is a, at all a good idea. Gonna do it, but it's not a good idea. All right, what do we have here? Battery. Good stuff. Everything else is just debris. Hey. If I remember right, this planet's supposed to be really good for, um... I think this planet's supposed to be really good for, like, wind and sun? I haven't seen the sun yet, but it might be, it might be good for both. Ah, oh, is that, okay, that looks like some compound over here. Okay. All we need is the printer. 
And then, and then everything gets so much easier. There we go. This is what I'm looking for. Ah. And then I think I'm probably gonna beeline for the tractor. Get the tractor down, because it's... If I remember right, the tractor is pretty easy to get. And, yeah, I mean, obviously it's slow as hell. But it's worth it. What do we get? Another battery? Looks like we got another battery. Alright, back we go. Before I start suffocating. Now, are some of these planets filled with oxygen? Because that actually would be kind of handy. Okay, plunk that down. Now, I have two batteries here. I'm just going to leave them on this platform. We're going to need them. Okay, a uh, small printer. Oh, I guess I'll just leave it there for the time being, because we need the small printer. Nope, wrong direction. Okay, so we need a medium platform B. We need some resin. Oxygen filters, beacon, no. Uh, resin. Buttloads of resin over here. Corn! I think I need... Actually, it's either two or three. Oh. We now have a goofy amount of both. Because, yeah, what I want to do is just get a basic base going. That should be good. Medium platform B. Oh. But either I'm in the way, or this is in the way. That's in the way. Now, can I put this on? No. Yeah, soil seems harder here. Might need drill, too. Hopefully, I'll be able to make it this time around. We'll see. Okay. Get that there. Get the wind up. Probably plunk a battery. Okay. So now that we've got that, we need to make a medium printer. Oh, easy peasy. Probably gonna need a little bit little bit more corn. Let's grab what we've dropped. Cause yeah, I'm gonna need another medium platform. I'm just going to kind of daisy chain these all over the place. Now what else? We're going to need research. What are you doing? That was a weird angle. Uh, let's see. This one should probably point outwards a little. What? Didn't work. You. There. Perfect. Let's see. Oh, I think you get more cosmetics when you unlock a core. Did I? Oh, no, that's multiplayer. C customization. Here we go. Uh, we unlocked the silver color set. Ooh. And we also have the Terran suit. Let's take a look at these. I'm not a big fan of the Terran set. I like the retro suit. And I like... I like heavy orange. What else do we have? Nothing else? No. So we've got to work on grabbing more. Okay, so I need more resin. Luckily, this planet is flush with it, and then we should figure out exactly what I need for the uh, the soil printer. Whoa. That thing... I think that thing just lobbed shit at me? It looks like it, it dropped like one hell of a deuce, or a gas bomb or something. Note to self, fear them. Okay, you... We make a large platform B. What else, what else can we make from this? Rover, thruster, medium printer. So it's mostly platforms. Okay. So we're reliant on this thing before I can do anything else. Still, having these little batteries is going to make life a lot easier for me. And hopefully we can get a bunch of lithium before we go back.
take it with us, use it for useful things. I don't know. It'd be nice if you could actually ship stuff from planet to planet. I wonder if in multiplayer you can actually, you can be on separate planets and stay functional. Because that sort of thing would be kind of rad. Okay. So, landing pad, research chamber. We need one resin. Because it looks like I'm going to have a whole bunch of uh, research, or, yeah, research opportunities just in the immediate area. And I'd be remiss not, not to capitalize on them. I like that word. It's a fun word. Okay. So, research chamber. Yeah, I'd like to start getting those out of the way. Okay, so what do we need next? We've got... Well, should we... Oh, we should get the soil printer, honestly. Let's see, can you sell stuff for bytes, or is it only space money? I actually have no idea. I know there's the trade platform, but I don't know how the trade platform works. I remember back in the day, you used to be able to just, like, throw hydrazine into everything and it would solve all of your problems. But that was kind of cheesy boring. Uh, that UI does not seem like it's happy with me. Yeah, it's worth a decent amount. Oh, we are totally out of juice. Well, let's take these two coppers. Let's make um, let's make some solar panels. It's not much, but still. Okay, you need a sh shredder to use the trade platform. Gotcha. Okay, so we've got the solid fuel thruster there. Life is good. So we want to figure out... Uh, let's see, which is the... We do have the soil centrifuge. Oh, I needed aluminum for this. Hmm. That's a gondromel. We had a field of resin, but it looks like... Well, we have a weird research item. Remember, these things can actually, like, hook up to themselves. So I don't actually need to leave them. How much of a sad bastardization can I... Can I make here? Can I do this? Oh, these poor cables. I'm just gonna keep doing it, because it makes me happy. Probably annoys someone. Okay. Kill these things before they gas me. Not actually sure if these. I think these are the only. These ones just like retaliate. But I will. I will do so because it's easier. Okay. What else we got around here? Bunch of that. A little bit more resin. Because we could use some. Oh. Stay away from this thing. None of that, you. Oh, oh, those are those are the gas grenades. Okay. Back we go. Table snakes make you happy. Yeah. I uh, I would not have passed muster at college for IT. Let me tell you. I think my teachers would have killed me. <laughs> okay, so we can't do the soil centrifuge, but we can get another large platform. So we might as well start with that. Let's see. Wow. We've been doing house hunting 
this entire week, and I, every once in a while I get an email being like, this is off-market. And sometimes it's like the places we've vi visited like hours before, and I'm like, huh. I'm just hoping I get the email that uh, mine's off the market because it's mine. Because <sighs> I don't really appreciate living in uh, a hotel. I can do it technically indefinitely, but it's not exactly good for me. I'm going to get real desperate if I'm still living in hotels in the ne over the course of the next week. Okay, so let's just leave that there. So what next? We've got a decent amount of bites. Um, natural cave system might kind of be necessary here. Now is this... Is there anything? Is there... Okay, there is stuff down here. What we should probably do is just make a, uh, a ramp down. I don't have much for compound, though. We should probably find a little bit more. Well, oh, there's another big old egg thing. Where are you? Can I kill you? I can. And it spits research candidates at me. Or samples. Sorry, words. Let's just get a bunch of bunch more compound. I guess I could actually put some tethers out here, but I kind of don't want to. I don't need to. What I should probably do, honestly, is actually get uh, an oxygen tank or two. Unfortunately, oh well. Later. Let's see, could a cable reach the hat? Uh, depends. Let's go back, hopefully before I suffocate. I don't know what that was, but that was extremely inconvenient. Okay. So... Because we've got the, um... Oh, you know what? Here's a dumb idea. I'm just gonna run all of these. I'm going to run these up to the, uh, the alien monument. Hmm, that might be too steep. Let's see. These are particularly flat. That's kind of flat-ish. Not flat enough, though. That should be fine. All I need is a, enough of a platform that I myself can walk up. Okay, there we go. Because, yeah, we have enough batteries. I should be able to just activate the, uh... The alien platform by just daisy chaining these together and then hooking up the whole base to it. It's a little unnecessary, but I mean, if it works, it works. How often do you actually have to have the ability to hook up an entire alien base to your, uh, your setup. Admittedly, it is going to bankrupt us for power. I don't think it's going to get any faster, so let's, let's wait for a little while. You can use the alien thing as a flattening base. Oh, neat. Oh, shit. So if you plant those, do you just get a research item off of it? That's awesome. Okay, so what do we do? Do we just go... Do we, where do we go? 
in here is kind of a decent spot. How steep is this? Decently steep. It can go steeper. Because we know, we know there's something down here. Uh, let's see. So let's let's make some tethers. Oh, that's a small printer. Tether bundle. There we go. Yeah, so what I want to do is just kind of extend down. And we do actually have several bits of organic that I shouldn't have in my inventory. And a battery that I shouldn't have in my inventory either. Once we're done researching, this will probably get a little easier. Is this that steep? We can go steeper. Because, yeah, what I want to do is be able to just kind of turbo slide down here. This does mean going back is going to suck a bit, but I don't know. And hopefully we'll just exit out into a cavern fairly quickly. I think we did. And then hopefully we can get just like a smidge of aluminum here. Eh, tether. Alright. There we go. Cause yeah, it doesn't it doesn't need to be too much aluminum. Oh, no tether. There we go. Okay, well, looks like we've got a little bit of something. Uh-oh. I'm really bad at keeping this one on the wall. Okay, there we go. Get out of here. Get out of here, you giant, giant thing. Perfect. And this has been knocked off. Okay, so what do we what do we even have down here? It looks like we've got I think that's aluminum. It's either aluminum or zinc, and I think it's aluminum. Laterite. I'm pretty sure that's aluminum. Let's see, how much is this game right now? I think it's 20 bucks. It's been consistently 20 bucks whenever I've looked. I don't actually know if it's ever been on sale. It probably has. Most games don't pull the, uh, was it Rimworld? No, Factorio. Factorio is the one that was like, I'm never dropping the, the price until the, uh, until the game is like fully complete. Which I think is entirely fair. Okay, so we want to make a smelting furnace. We need two resin. Because, yeah, we should have all of the aluminum in the world. I just gotta go find a little bit of resin. That looks like a bunch of corn. Corn! But first, we kill the lava. A free egg thing. Oh god, we we're gonna have so much research. The lava has been slain. Grab these and corn. We don't need too much. Just, just enough. Time to go back. We... I'd bring that along, but we'll come back for it. Okay. Jump. I wonder how many of these natural holes have been me. Probably a number. Oh god. I might die. I'm 
Nope, we're good. We are just barely good. Okay, so we want to make not a soil centrifuge smelting furnace. Yeah, note to self, next time I do this, I'm bringing, I'm bringing enough for the soil centrifuge. Unfortunately, it's too big to bring in my backpack. Uh, but if I can either just bring one along or, uh, either bring one along or bring just the aluminum, I'll be able to immediately just start dumping soil into things. Because, yeah, that, that soil centrifuge is a lot more useful. I gr gave it credit for. Has not a whole lot of bites for a minute. Damn. That's some that's some aluminum. Right, let's let's go back and kill the remaining plants. It looks like that's a solar panel there. Yoink. I'll have a plant free living situation. One that doesn't fart fart on me. Try and kill me in the process. I think I went the wrong direction. Oh well. Grab that. Grab that. I don't remember that being this deep. Oh, back we go. Let's see, you could use the pack for it. I don't think you can actually pack up a soil centrifuge and have it be small enough to fit in your inventory. I think I need a... I think I'd need a considerably larger... setup for that sort of thing. Uh, I also need some more power. Damn. Okay, well we got the single aluminum. So what do I need for the soil centrifuge? Two compound. Dang it. Dang. Dang, dang it. This place is just going to be a bloody wasteland by the time I'm done with it. Oh well. I mean, it could be worse. Do you have anything lurking at your roots, whore plant? There is... no. Alright. Oh. Are these planted? It looks like they've been planted, so I'll just leave them alone for a little while. I might have to knock them around. Because, yeah, I... Hmm. Man, I, I am not thinking... I'm not going to say not thinking straight. I'm just tired enough that, like, thoughts come slow. Okay. Oil centrifuge. Finally! Okay, and it's day. We've got... We've got plenty of... We've got plenty of wind. Actually... Can I get... Can we actually look into getting some of these? So, copper and glass. So, we actually could make this stuff. Like, copper and glass is easy to come by. Let's probably do glass and, glass and ceramics. So, I can actually just make a buttload of these. We'll start with that. And we could just go bananas, making wind power. Uh, we need corn, actually. And possibly, you know what? Let's make... Let's make one small generator. I guess I could make a larger generator, but eh. Yeah, we've got all this organic lying around that I have, like, no use for. I don't really want. Okay, so where's all the corn? It's over on this hill. We should probably extend a beacon train. Uh, beacon? Uh, yes. Actually, we, we definitely want... We want to start leaving, leaving some tethers behind. I've got a bunch of them, and with the soil centrifuge, we can get so many more. And this way I don't have to worry about actually running out of oxygen along. What the... Alright. Game gets a little 
Buggy. Okay, back you go. They were running into like weird collision issues that just get popped up into the sky. Or it like just kind of breaks? It's confusing. Oops. The reaction times are kind of bad too. Part of the reason why I haven't loaded up uh, any of the harder games that I need need to play. I'd like to. You know, I, I've... I don't want to like run out of all of my my current series. But yeah, I'm gonna need God Eater, and I, I don't think I'm going to be able to do God Eater today, even if I wanted to. Okay, are we? No, we've got space for one more. Okay, there we go. This thing, I just. Thing? Looks like you can replant it. And that? Alright. Yay! So now we've just got like a boatload of research that I, I can't even do anything with. I'm, I, I think I might have to get another research. And going. Unfortunately, it looks like it's going painfully slowly. We're barely generating any power here. That's going to go for days. Well, I'll just leave them in the giant research pile. Okay, what is this? Soil centrifuge. Cool. Check that over there. Large platform B. Let's see. Has Forager received an update yet? Or a ground? Forager has, actually. Um... We could play a little bit of Forager tonight, maybe. Let's see if I research the large solar panel. I... Yes and no. Um... So... I think I can, or I'll, I will be able to soon. My main problem with the, uh, the large solar panel is I'm not sure if I have the res resources for it. Also, I'm not entirely sure if we actually get that much sun out here. It seems like I might be on the wrong side of the planet for that. Where's that soil centrifuge? There you are. I kind of wish this thing would actually tank a lot more. And you could be a little bit more, like, picky. Oh, well. The Moonlighter got an update with pets. Yeah, I didn't just... I really don't like Moonlighter, to be totally honest. I know a lot of people went kind of bananas for it, but, like, I thought it was actually kind of generic and thin. I'd like to play a deeper dungeon exploration game. Like, much deeper. Yeah, really, it's just the game was too shallow for its own good. And honestly, it's one of those where it's like, well, I've also beaten it. Going back to it right now, I don't think would bring me a whole lot of enjoyment. I think it'd just be like, alright, well, it's slightly better than it was. It, it kind of reminds me of that Swords of Ditto game. You know, a game that, like, could have been really amazing, but it feels like the procedural generation actually worked really hard against it. Because it wasn't interesting, it was just like a handful of different room types that you just go through over and over and over again. It's like, I think if the whole thing had been like really specifically hand designed, and like... Not, not exactly curated. But... What's a good example of a game? I mean, honestly, any of the Legend of Zelda games is pretty fun. And if you actually, like, hand-designed it, you could actually control the pacing. Which I don't think you really get out of a whole lot of, like, procedural generation games. There's another chair I can use as a... 
Ugh, I can use this as a footrest. That's good. I am tired. But no, I, I guess I just really had really high hopes with Moonlighter. I thought it was going to be the next Reketeer. It was not. It wasn't that close. It was unfortunate. I don't know. So this is left. A bunch. Okay, so we need glass and ceramic. Let's see. If I do quartz... Make it less than this? So I'm just going to get it all. Okay, let's just pull that out. We're just going to make a big base out here. I don't necessarily know what I'm going to use it for, but we might as well just have a big base just around. So I will admit, I'm not actually sure if I know uh, if Reketeer was actually good or not. I don't even know if it's Reketeer or Reseteer. I always, I always thought of it as Reseteer, but... Ugh. Okay, so things are going slowly. We need we need more medium wind turbines, just to kind of throw it around. Or throw it around too. Uh, I specifically want to open up that... That alien thing, even if we don't need it that much. Also going to just flatten out everything. The flat base is a good base. What is going on over here? Oh, I see. It's unfinished. Okay. That's a bit better. I think I ruined everything. Or we're out of power. No, we're, we're out of power. Okay. Let's let's undo Hella Cable Spaghetti. And try and flatten some of these things down. I think they're good. I think we're good. And yeah, we've got a nicer, flatter base. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? What else do we even need to do? We've got the glass. Hopefully that'll be enough for... Compound resin organic clay. Two clay? Two clay is probably enough. Water. You unanchored everything. Yeah. But it was for a good cause. Okay, uh, let's see. We still got we've still got this bit of soil just kicking around. Might as well get rid of this. This thing is still going to take like forever and two days. 